All aspects of work in a healthcare setting rely on health professionals being able to build trust and rapport with their clients, who in turn may not always be willing or able to connect. While the strategies outlined in these teaching and learning sequences are general, um, given the power imbalance in a care relationship, they're worth specific attention so that carers get off to a good start with clients and have more meaningful relationships. They are also things that most care staff will not have considered in relation to their work before. Building skills and confidence and the ability to manage these relationships at work has a direct impact on clients. The resources are aligned with the, lit lit the literacy and numeracy learning progressions, specifically the using strategies to communicate and interactive listening and speaking progressions. The first teaching and learning sequence is about making clients feel comfortable with you. Learners evaluate speaking strategies, watch a carer in action, and then practice the strategies themselves. The second teaching and learning sequence focuses on body language specifically, which is really important given the multicultural nature of the healthcare workforce and the fact that body language is so culturally specific in terms of the messages given, intended, and received. The final sequence is about strategies to use to encourage learners to have richer, more meaningful interactions with their clients, to get to know them as individuals and understand what's important for them. Music